little thing that act that actually you can put like your mouth in it and like yeah. So, it's so basically, this is representing like a bald head. Well, not right now. Yeah, not right now. This but one is representing a bald yeah. head. Yeah. So, what you're gonna do is squish it from these sides that it has Squeeze. here, and it's gonna start growing. Oh, if the temperature wasn't that um, cold. cold, it would be more like because easy. It's, uh, what's it called? The name of the can the it's soft. It's tamarind soft candy. Tamarind soft. Yeah. So it as it's much really as you soft. squeeze it, it will like appear. So it like that's why it's called pelon pelo rico because it's like a ball. Yeah, and, hair. and you're supposed to eat it until so, yeah. the white thing reaches the green thing. So you eat this and it's really delicious. It's tamarind candy, regular tamarind. It doesn't have like any additional. Well, I consider any additional flavors. It actually mm -hmm. says here. Oh, you see, I'm right. Tamarind original. Mhm. Mm original tamarind. <laughs> So that's all you have to do, like squish it. Put Honestly, it in your mouth. Mexican candies are the type of candies that if you put a lot in your mouth, they'll taste better than if you try just little pieces of it. Mhm. Mm oh yeah. I love this candy. If I had to choose one of them, I would definitely choose this one. For so many reasons. This is also a really popular. Like I think it's the most popular Mexican candy I actually know. Oh, you know which ones are almost as popular? <gasps> I'm gonna go with my red one. Okay, oh, yes. So, guys, these are like super, super, duper popular. And, like, if you have. These are top. And somehow, in one of our little videos, he was eating actually. I actually this eat one. these very often. You know, this one's the spiciest one, and this one's the one that. Because people say that it looks like meat. It's not meat, it's tamarind candy. Tamarind is a dark fruit, it's really delicious. But it has some chili powder on top of it, so people it's like, oh, it looks like meat with rust. I'm like, no, that's just candy with some chili powder on top. But it's dark. So this one is tamarind, but without the chili powder. This is like a really sweet one. Sweet. We're gonna demonstrate you later now. Um, this one is a mango one. Like oh. it has tamarind and a mango. So this like, is very friendly for all the kids because it's really sweet and yeah. it has like a very but long as flavor. We repeat it like. Kids, like four year old kids, actually go for the spicy one. Like, it's just a natural thing. I would, like, honestly, if they gave me to choose five or ten of these or one of these, I'll pick this one. Yeah. So, yeah, we're gonna demonstrate you the. Okay, are you good? I'm gonna do the yellow one okay. and you do the. The mango one is basically the same thing but with flavor. Okay. So, this one. This is the difference, okay? It does not look like meat and it does not look like rust. So, this is tamarind. This is a sweet one. This and is that's a spicy, a spicy one. one. You can see a little difference between them, the color, and it has a little bit of white because it's like the sugar. Yeah, it has like some kind of sugar on it. It's really good. So this one's sweet, and this one, the red one's spicy. And the mango is a friendly one. It has a little bit of both. Yeah. So this one, you basically just put it like in your mouth and bite it, or what I do because I love enjoying my, like, my candy. Mm. It's not that I, hard. It's not I hard at like, all. I just like leave it in my tongue for a little while. Mm, I love it. That's how I do. I've, eat, I've eaten these like in two videos while I'm recording because these are yeah. like my snack. So yeah. And that's how you eat them. It's not a big deal and it's not spicy like if you're gonna die. Okay, so. Mm. Those are basically the same. No, no, no. I want to do this. Okay, I'm not gonna open mine because I want to take this for later. So this is called banderilla. Which um, means like the flag stick. Like just the, without the flag, only the stick. <laughs> yeah. So this is basically, I'm gonna open it, but I'm not gonna eat it because it doesn't have like a... It's tamarind candy. Most of the candies in Mexico are based like on chili and tamarind. Tamarind, it's not spicy on itself. It's only sweet and sour. But most of the times it's added chili to make it like more flavorable and more like... Because Mexican people like to eat spicy. Yeah. Things. So this is the thing. Well, <laughs> this one is they are really exaggerated in it. Yeah. <laughs> I got a really good one. No, this, you should actually, buy it. these you are really good. Well, yeah, you just do... It, it has some tamarind seeds on it. Like these little bumps are tamarind, are seeds, tamarind seeds. And those you should not eat them because... Those you just lick you off. Could, you could eat like the little cover thing. Yeah, eat the cover. Good. But like the seed itself, you don't eat it. You don't eat it. 
So you just have to bite it. Oh, that looks like it. I got a seed. Show them what you're supposed to leave behind. No, I think it was another one. Oh, it was like a seed? It was like those little pieces that they leave. Yeah. I want to get a seed to show you. I mean, it's going to be disgusting if I show them. No, it's not because it's a seed. So they know how the seed looks like. It's just a black seed. Because it's a fruit. It's just a black seed. I don't know where there is. What's well, a, a brownish, brownish seed? Actually, not black. Yeah, it's like brown. I mean, you can like be with it in your mouth, and it won't like cause it really big trouble. Okay. But Dueling. Dueling. So we got. Did we get another one? No, I think that's all. Okay, so we just got two of them for some weird reason. Yeah. But they're different flavor. Well. Kind of. This one is strawberry and chocolate, and this is his vanilla and um, chocolate. These are cool. Uh, I called one. which one do you want? These are called Duvalin. Which means Duvalin, and um, these are good because m most people that I know that are not like oh. Latino like these candies because they're like very sweet and it's like for example this one is chocolate and strawberry. Wait, I messed. I kind of messed up. It's not. Like chocolate, chocolate hazelnut, which is basically the oh, same, yeah. but it's like hazelnut. Yeah. Strawberry hazelnut. Yeah, but it kind of right. tastes like chocolate, actually. So we didn't have like the little spoons because actually, if you buy it by a packet, it has like those little spoons, mm, and you don't have like right. to mess up your like, you know, if you don't want to like do it with your finger or like yeah, your like tongue. This. And I honestly always like mix them because it's soft candy, so it's. Almost liquid. No, it's not liquid at all. It's like soft, just soft candy. And you're supposed to like get the little spoon that it comes with, but they didn't give us the spoons. They should have. I'm gonna like. I don't know. You just like mix it, and you it see? will make like a strawberry and hazelnut. And mm. there's actually a Japanese candy that we tried that's kind of like the same, yeah. but it comes with some like little sticks, like like bread sticks, like cookie sticks, actually. Mm, I love it. And that was vanilla with chocolate, right? I used to have like an obsession with this candy when I was like eight years old. You know, when you're a child, you eat just a lot of candy. Mm. Oh, I want to explain all the lollipops. Because they're basically all the same, but I'm going to tell the difference. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no. So these are basically all consist on the same principle. The inside, except for this one. Okay, so basically the outside is spicy and the inside is sweet, sweet, sweet. So it's gonna, if you do not enjoy spicy things or salty things, or salty things, it's gonna get you um, like. You're not gonna like. You're it. not gonna this like one, it. This one, you may like it better than the other. Yeah, chicken, this one, the one that looks like a chicken, it doesn't actually actually taste like chicken. None of these taste of what they look like. This one doesn't taste like like corn. This one doesn't taste like mango, and this one doesn't taste like chicken. They only have these presentations, mm -hmm. but they all consist of sweet. And salty, so Sweet, this spicy. One, sorry, if you if you had good teeth, you could bite them and just like enjoy them like that. Or if you like enjoy salty things and spicy things, like you could eat them like that, like like them. The mango is one of my favorites because it's the one that has more chili powder. And honestly, I don't think it's that spicy. But people that I do know that that are like, um, like like white a hundred percent they say that this is too spicy for them but I honestly don't find it spicy at all and once you we repeat I repeat this three-year-old kids eat that like I just don't understand I can't but yeah beware I mean, because many people say oh it has a chicken here because it does have a chicken it's called pollo asado which is um what's um, it called roasted roasted chicken. chicken yeah but it does not taste like a chicken it's not even meant to all. taste like chicken yeah, yeah. It's just like a sweet can, like a lollipop. This and doesn't this taste like corn, but it looks like corn, but it's sweet. Or maybe it does not like really like a corn, but it's This corn. one's mango, and it might taste like mango. Yeah, and it does look like a mango too. Now this one right here. Oh, I love this This one. is a traditional Mexican candy. Yeah, Miguelito. They sell powder, like tajin kind of, kind of, not exactly. This is called 
Raqueta enchilada. Which means um, spicy racket. Is that how you call it? Yeah. Like what you're supposed to, yeah. Like the tennis players, the racket. So this one consists of a lot of things. It's sweet. It has chamoy, which is why it's red. It's sweet. It's spicy. And there's it's a little all, bit there's that. also yeah. We got the 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 one that's spicy, but there is also another one that's like just sweet. This is yeah. like the chamoy one. This is the chamoy one. The, yeah. the the most red one is the one that's made of chamoy, and it's honestly my favorite one. Yeah, this is really good. And just the just the spicy. Oh, here's the pretty the candy. That's so cute. Yeah. We're gonna do this one. Right now. Oh, I, let's do these. I'm like okay. Okay, so. This is what natural tamarind looks like on its non, like 100% candy form. So once they get the tamarind fruit, it, the tamarind fruit comes like with a hard, um, like Texture. a hard. No, it's hard on the outside. It's like once you peel it, like for Shape. example, um, like the pineapple kind of. You have to take out, the skin out from the pineapple and the inside is sweet. So mm -hmm. the same thing goes with the tamarind fruit. So the outside of the tamarind fruit is hard and um, the inside is sweet and it has the seeds. So this is how it looks like. And it's like really squishy. Very natural. Now, okay. I do want to show you these. Um, it's just tamarind pulp on a little bag. You're supposed to like, like this. Yeah, pulp tamarind, like the, mm. the instruction says. Are you going to show them? Or yeah, I'm going to show, gonna show them. I'm going to try it because I love it. So, basically with your fingers you have to push it up till where you bit it. And this is what I, I was excited to show you, so. It has a lot of seeds because it's 100% natural. You will even find like the the peeling part of that from the tamarind like in, it's in this. It's 100% edible. Well, no. You're not supposed to eat the seed. Yeah, I mean you could. <laughs> the seed comes with like a little like a little um, like a bag like a little bag the bag is edible and it's delicious so you with the bag and the remaining part of it is this seed did you see the difference it was like a light brown and now it's a, like dark brown yeah that's right this is the seed and you keep eating off of it and it's delicious and i don't know why people say that it looks gross i honestly don't understand this it's fruit and it's, it's sweet. It's just like strawberry. It's not that spicy, right? No, not spicy. I don't want that baby. See? Two seeds. It's gonna come like with five or six seeds. Mm -hmm. But everything is edible. Oh. Not Remember these guys? Remember Squinkle. these? This is their big brother. Literally. This is this is called the squinclote, which means the big one. <laughs> so this is their brother. This one is the mango one. Yeah. Then I have the watermelon. Oh one. no, it's pineapple one. Oh my god. This is basically the same thing. Basically the same thing. Yeah. No, this is this has a big difference. I don't which think one? it's the same. It has a thing inside. Oh yeah. yeah. My mom. Well, the loves, outside is exactly the same thing. My mom loves this. I, maybe this looks bad for you guys, but it's not for the Mexican people. So.